Good afternoon everyone. We meet again in engineering geology course. Today we will be discussing on rock structures. All the rock masses have some features which are called as its structure. The structure can be classified into two classes. First primary structures, secondary structures, which is secondary structures has two types of movement epirogenic movement or organic movement the primary structures in igneous rock are the flow structure fracture structure to the to stress created on a pulling of the magma the primary structures of sedimentary rocks is stratification the secondary rocks the secondary structures are more important in sedimentary and metamorphic rocks in addition to this physical movement a large amount of chemical action both organic and inorganic have affected the rock formation especially at the faults and the faults Terzaghi calls them as a chemical defects Structural features Rock structures There are three major structures in rock. The first layer is joints, second is fault, and third is fault. Joints Joints indicates a crack or separation or fracture in the rock without displacement or along with no noticeable displacement has taken place. A joint can be open or closed and closed joints may be invisible. In quarries, the spacing of joints give the largest size of blocks of stone like marble which can be quarried. In general, we can have three sets of joints in rock, one along the bed and the other two at right angles to it. Rayolite has closely spaced irregular joints. Joints are important in relation to the engineering work such as quarrying of stones, formation of rock slides, availability of groundwater for water supply. As water can easily flow through these joints, they are important also in all stages of dam construction and tunneling. Faults. Faults in many places, the anti cleans may be eroded and the rock may appear as the outcrop. Folding is important in quarrying of sedimentary rock. If the folding has made the joints in rocks slanting, it may be desirable to make the quarry floor also slanting to get good pieces of rock. In dams, leakage can take place along the faults. Deep strike and angle of plunge. Faults. Overthrust. This is the image of an overthrust. Cliffage. Minor structural features in sedimentary rocks produced by erosion. There are four in numbers which are as follows. First, unconformity. In layers, outliers, overlap. Well, that is all for this session. Until we meet again in the next session. Thank you.